In this short video, I'm going to show you how to create a pricing table in Wix. Unfortunately, since Wix doesn't support such a functionality by default, we are going to have to make use of a third-party platform. Don't worry though, it's completely free and also very easy to set up. So the first thing I want you to do is to go ahead and click the first link in the description of this video, which will take you to the elfside.com website. Once you click on the link, this is what the page that you're going to land on will look like. From here, go to the navigation menu at the top of the screen and look for the widgets button. In my case, it's right here to the left. I want you to hover over it and then go all the way down to e-commerce and then look for um, pricing table. In my case, it's near the bottom. Click on that and then this will take you to the pricing table widgets page. From here, simply click create widget for free and then this will take you to the template section here. As you can see, I've got four different pricing table templates to choose from. Don't worry about the actual design of the um, template itself. These are things that we can change later on, like the colors or the contents and um, the different buttons basically that you see. So choose the one that best resonates with what you try to achieve. In my case, I'm gonna go for pricing columns like these because they look really nice and clean and I like the look of them. So I'm gonna go over these, then click continue with this template in the bottom left corner of the screen right here. And then this is where we can customize each individual column. So for example, as you can see, there's three columns already, but if I add another one right here, it sets a, another one right here that we can then customize to our liking, depending on what we want to add. In my case, I'm not gonna go ahead and add anything because I don't wanna make this video super long. So as you can see, you can customize anything that you want within these columns right here. On the left-hand side, you can customize the actual layout as well as the appearance. So for example, if you don't like it as columns, you can make it into a table like this or a grid if you prefer. Here, you can also turn off the pictures if you don't want to have pictures, the titles, and a bunch of other things. As you can see, there's a lot of customization opportunities. Then appearance, of course, if you don't like the overall look of it. So for example, if you don't want this color uh, of the buttons to be um, this light brownish, you can change it to whatever you want. In my case, I'm gonna go for orange, just like this. And yeah, so once you're happy with the contents as well as the design of the pricing table, what you need to do is click add to website for free here at the bottom left corner of the screen and then this is going to create the widget for free in just a couple of seconds you'll be taken to this page right here but before you actually see this you will be asked to log in into the elf site platform you can create a standalone account straight through the platform itself or you can log in through google which is what i've done because it's quick and easy once you're logged in it will take you to this page right here and then all you have to do here is click on publish in the top right corner of the screen and then here we need to select the plan. Since this is the first widget we're using from the Elf site platform, we can opt for the free plan right here. However, in the future, if you do decide to use any of the additional widgets, because they have so many of them, um, you will have to opt for one of the premium plans right here. So for now, we're gonna go over the free plan, click select, and then in a couple of seconds, our code will be generated here. So as you can see, copy code, click on this, and then let's head over to the uh, Wix website. Um, as you can see, I'm already in my Wix editor and then I want you to go over to the page where you want to add the pricing table. In my case, I want it on the homepage here and as you can see, I've also got plenty of space for it. So um, all you have to do here is um, head over to search in the top right corner of the screen and then simply search for HTML. Wait for it to load and then underneath add to site, which will be near the top, click on embed. On the left hand side, you see popular embeds right here. And then all you have to do is click embed HTML. And then this is going to add an HTML box to your Wix website. From here, all you need to do is paste the code that we just copied into this box and then click on update. And in just a couple of seconds, your pricing table widget will be added to your Wix website. From here, simply resize it accordingly. As you can see, this is what I want it to look like. So I'm going to size it accordingly. Make sure that uh, it's big enough so that the scroll functionality is not available because it looks much nicer and much cleaner like that. So let's go ahead and preview it and see what it looks like for real. As you can see, it looks really nice and everything works. The buttons work just like that. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's how to add a pricing table in Wix. If you have any questions, please let me know down in the comments below and I'll do my best to help you out.